Good morning, you guys. I ordered one thing from the Sephora uh, VIB 15% off sale. And, sorry, it happened to be the Laura Mercier Baked Blush Bronze Compact in Ritual. You know, kind of a cult favorite here on YouTube. So I decided I would give it a shot. Um, I also have the Hard Candy Blush Crush Baked Blush in Bombshell. And this is supposed to be a dupe for the ritual from Laura Mercier. And Swoozy had done a video. She had actually gotten two of these um, to see if the colors would be different based on the swirl. Whoop, oh, I just dropped the plastic thing. In the container, and in her video, it didn't seem like there was really any difference. Um, this is my bombshell and my Laura Mercier. Now, they look quite different in the pan, so the question is going to be, how do they look on the skin? And so I'm going to swatch first the bombshell. I'm going to put it in the inner part of my arm because the skin there is quite smooth and light. And then I'm going to swirl the Ritual and put it next to it. Now on Swoozy, these look very similar. On me, I think they look quite different. Oh, well, okay, awkwardness. This is the Bombshell, and this is the Ritual. So on me, the Bombshell is much more red, and the um, Ritual is more of a brown color. Oh, you like my bruise? Yeah. So. Um, what I'm planning on doing next is applying the Ritual here to my left cheek. What I like about it is I don't need separate bronzer and blush. So there is the Ritual. And I'm going to use the back side of the brush and apply the hard candy on my right cheek. I don't have eyeliner on today. My eyes have been burning again. So I don't know what the problem is. So blend that out. So ritual bombshell. I definitely see a difference. Now it may not be huge, but on me the ritual is darker and more brown and the bombshell is lighter and more red. So you guys tell me. So I got the 15% off of the Ritual. I think it's normally 36, so whatever that discount is. And then the samples I chose were the Yves Saint Laurent, the YSL Touche Clot sample, and it comes in number one, number two, and number 4.5. So these are the samples. And these little samples really do annoy me, but you know, you get them in your order, so why not? Then I got the Guerlain um, face treatment oil. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that French word. And uh, the ingredients are agua, water, glycerin, pentaline, glycol. So this has a bunch of chemicals in it. But I thought I'd give it a try. I'm not sure what you're supposed to face treatment oil, firming, lift, and tone. Okay, and then uh, the final sample that I got was from Clinique, and it is the Super Primer and the Beyond Perfecting. It's their foundation and concealer, kind of like the Tarte Found Sealer. And mine came in 24 Golden, which is pretty dark. So I don't know that that's going to work for me, but at least I can give it a try on my face and see if it's something that I like. 
And then for my 100 point, um, what do they call them? 100 point gift? 100 point, I don't know, 100 point. It's the Dior Dior Show Maximizer Lash. It is a lash plumping serum and it's supposed to give you volume times two. Okay, and this is what it looks like. I have not opened it. I'm still using my Latisse. So, trying to decide what's burning my eyes, if it's just allergies. They don't usually burn without my makeup, so I don't know. Gosh. I don't want to give up mascara and eyeliner, that's for sure. So far, I'm not burning too badly. Although, if it is my eyeliner, I can always go to um, use shadow as a liner. But, so, again, ritual, bombshell. You tell me what you think. I'm going to turn this off and give you a different look. So, I don't know. Is it worth the $36? I'll use it. I'm going to keep it. I'm not going to return it. I wasn't really sure, but when I see the difference um, with the bombshell and the Ritual, I like the Ritual color better. And um, I'll, if I remember, I'll put Swoozie's video below. So getting ready to get out and run my errands, get my packages mailed, the prize mail. Um, my Latisse is getting low, so I'm going to have to reorder that pretty soon, probably. Maybe I won't reorder it, and I'll use that Lash Serum and see what happens. Oh, and then at Walmart yesterday, they finally got these in because I need more eyeshadow palettes. But this is the Blushed Nudes. It's what I'm wearing today. And I've come to the conclusion that all of these um, pinky, purpley, whatever palettes all tend to kind of give me the same effect so but uh, really nice so there's fallout they're powdery there's fallout but I think it gave a good look um, they were easy to work with and the lighter shades you don't see very well but you don't see them because they're lighter shades but that is this uh, this color here which reminds me of and my Naked 3 palette, which I'm still working on, it reminds me of the, what's it called? The Limit. So let me swatch those. So this is the Limit, and this is the one from the Maybelline palette. And I am such a fail when it comes to swatching. And then you get to look at my underarm. Maybe I'll swatch it back here. Okay. I don't remember which was which. This is the Urban Decay. And this is the Maybelline. The Maybelline is not as doesn't have as much color to it. It's definitely lighter, but so this is Urban Decay, and that's the Maybelline right there. Pretty comparable. Um, there's a difference in the quality, but there are. Um, oh, and then let's uh, let's just do one more, okay? So here is Buzz from Urban Decay. Put that one there. I haven't even swatched this one yet. And then this one here in the blushed nudes in the Maybelline. Let's put that next to it. Well, they're close. That is from Urban Decay and that's the Maybelline. So, anyway, and this was uh, 11 and change and this is $54. So, there you go. There you have it. A uh, mini comparison. All right, I'm almost at 10 minutes and I've got to get my butt moving. So thanks for coming along and watching and I'll just talk to you guys later. Bye.